In this microscope slide right here, there is a fiber that a Morgellons patient said came out of their skin. Now, the CDC says they think that that patient may have put the thread or fiber in the skin themselves. And that doesn't sit well with one OSU Tulsa researcher. For people who claim to suffer from Morgellons, what has this disease taken from you? My life. Not I have a lot. You feel disgusting. You feel dirty. Or the sister of someone with the symptoms. What's so crazy? It is crazy. It sounds crazy. He called one day and said he thought he had bed bugs. It's an almost never-ending battle. April's brother reacted like many who have more gallons. He threw everything he owned away, including my stuff that was at his house. Within months, her brother was put in a psychiatric hospital. Tolson Jimmy Roy knows that struggle. It absolutely makes you want to isolate yourself, stay away from people. You don't shake hands. You don't have girlfriend anymore. Because of the disease, he had to quit his job. Morgellons patients say that they can pull out fibers from open sores on their body, fibers that look like these threads right here. And what does Morgellons feel like? Most patients describe it as feeling like you're rolling around in fiberglass. It's 24 hours a day, seven days a week. OSU Tulsa researcher Dr. Randy Wymore is trying to uncover the truth about Morgellons. The, the fear of the unknown is a horrible thing. The feds appear to be fine with keeping Morgellons in the gray area. A CDC study was inconclusive about whether the disease even exists. Others claim patients are implanting threads in their skin to get attention. It's the CDC. You trust the CDC. In the conclusion, they state that they were not able to conclude if this was a new disease or an existing pathology, such as a delusional disorder. Dr. Wymore wrote a paper questioning the people in the CDC study whether they even had more gallons. Not one patient in their study population that they took through the whole process had fibers emerging from intact skin. So federal acknowledgement or not, he's sticking with his story. Oh, there's no question that, that, that there is a real physiological event going on with Morgellons. Dr. Wymore says he can envision pinpointing the cause of Morgellons. We are making progress in the next five years, something that April has waited years to see. Yeah, mystery disease, but at least call it a disease or an illness or sickness. And for Jimmy Roy, can't come soon enough. What has this disease taken from you? My life. I, I have a lot. In West Tulsa, Adam Palooka, Fox 23 News.